What is going on guys? Grave here. Yesterday we got some info about the mid-season update for Black Ops Cold War Season 1. Before I get into all the details, make sure if you're not subscribed to take a second to hit the subscribe button. I really would appreciate it. If you are subscribed, make sure you have notifications turned on. If you enjoy the content, hit the like button and be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing. Of course, we've got a little bit of info, not a lot of info about exactly what the update will entail like in detail for you know weapon nerfs changes and things like that but we do know uh Treyarch did announce the mid-season update for black ops cold war season one will arrive next thursday january the 14th on all platforms the mid-season update will feature content for multiplayer and zombies uh, of course nothing about what will happen in warzone uh, i'm sure they will make some changes to warzone but of course raven software is handling warzone right now uh, for the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War game. So they they may uh, release some information a little bit later. When it comes to some of the things they're going to be adding, they're going to have a new fire team map uh, for Fire Team Dirty Bomb, a new mode for 6v6 called Dropkick. It's supposed to be a frantic game of nuclear hot potato, pretty much is how they uh, worded it. A new mode for zombies called Crank. And PlayStation exclusive raid uh, will be added to the Onslaught playlist. Now, of course, you know, Onslaught is a playstation exclusive mode that is for zombies that's going to be out of course for, for a year so no one on uh, xbox or pc will be able to play this until the end of this year the end of 2021 which is kind of goofy in my opinion i talked about that in a video a long time back when it was first announced uh but also new dark aether intel uh, is going to be a part of the playstation exclusive uh thing for zombies as well so like i said we're going to get that new map which is going to be called uh sanatorium um, that's going to be for the big mode, Fire Team Dirty Bomb. I was hoping we were going to get some more maps, maybe for 6v6, but nothing kind of said about that just yet. Uh, the one interesting thing is that I'm looking forward to is what the weapon changes are going to be. What's the weapon tuning going to be? Because you all know, if we look back at Modern Warfare, uh, you know, every season with Modern Warfare, you know, you had the big season update and then you had the mid season update along with, you know, small updates in between there uh, at times. But I'm kind of curious to see if they're going to change anything up with the weapons anything up with the meta uh anything up with you know perks because they've done a lot of changes uh, as of late it's not just been weapon changes it's been perk changes to you know move things around you know depending on what perk does what kind of like uh they did with how you know ninja used to shield you from field mics and now that was moved of course to uh spycraft so I'm kind of curious to see if anything else changes like that there's been a lot of talk about you know nerfing the dmrs and things again in Warzone, that may happen. Uh, I'm not sure. Like I said, they have not really listed anything they're looking to do just yet. I would assume within the next couple of days, maybe start of next week, Treyarch will kind of start giving us some hints of what they're looking to do. You know, usually they will kind of talk about what they're thinking about changing, uh, what the community's been discussing kind of before the update is released. So we'll kind of have to wait and see on that. But I just want to make a quick video letting you guys know that that mid-season update will be coming out next Thursday, January the 14th. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, I'll catch you all next time. Peace.